Hi, in this lesson we're going to take a closer look at light types and different ways to use seam lights to create cool effects. So let's get started. There are four types of seam lights available to use in Unity. Directional, Spot, Point, and Area. Area lights are generally used for rare special effects and involves emitting light from a given plane. We'll focus on the first three commonly used lights for this lesson. Directional lights act like a sun in your game environment. They don't have an identified source and will light your scene the same no matter where it's positioned. New Unity projects typically include a directional light game object by default. Spotlights do have a specified source and range. They're constrained to an angle creating a cone-shaped region. Think of spotlights as a flashlight. Point lights also have an identified source. They send out rays of light in all directions equally from the source point. Point lights are helpful for illuminating areas with lamps or creating sparks and explosions. During the Unity tutorials in this lesson, you'll be adding new light types and adjusting their light properties. These properties include not only the type of light to use, but also might define its color, intensity level, range, angle, and types of shadows that it creates. You'll continue practicing with Unity in our park game environment by using various lighting techniques to create a dusk or evening scene. Now that you know a little more about different scene lights available to use in Unity, it's your turn to light up our park game environment at dusk. 